Here at Community, I have never felt more supported as a leader from executive leadership um, in the building to um, network leadership throughout the network. I feel like I can always take any questions, concerns uh, to my leaders. I have great support from them, but then also my peers, um, the directors and managers I work with. We all are in this business to deliver patient care and we have all our jobs for patients and we really need to work well together. And I feel like the network really does that um, seamlessly between outpatient to inpatient, from emergency department to inpatient uni units to procedure areas. This is the second career for me. I was originally a branch manager for Chase Bank for um, a handful of years. My wife, she's a nurse, and she's the one that has always encouraged me to um, follow um, a dream that I had to become a nurse. She supported me in that. So when I got into nursing school, I applied for a job at Community Health Network as, uh, as a patient care tech. I uh, became um, a preceptor while I was a tech, which I absolutely enjoyed that. Uh, once I became a nurse, I um, was hired into the network, into the same unit I was working on, and then moved over into the ICU, and I was in the ICU for a few years when my manager offered me the manager position. So I was born and bred in the network in my nursing career and um, moved up through the ranks. When I was a tech, when I was a nurse, the leaders that um, uh, my director at the time, she told me, she goes, I, I could wipe a butt with the best of them. Even though I'm the director, it doesn't matter. Like if I can help a patient, if I could take a patient to the bathroom, if I could get them water, if I could get them a, blan a warm blanket, anything like that, whatever we have to do, and she would always tell me, she goes, you know, nurses adapt to the situation. You adapt to what the patient needs or what your staff needs. And I've always felt that from uh, my manager at the time, Tony Reynolds, and the director, uh, Linda Herman, and that's how I try to lead. There's days that I'll be dressed up, but there's days that I know we're short or they need something, so I will come in and scrubs and I will just jump in with them. And when you jump in the trenches with them, they know I'm not just telling them, hey, can you go do this? I'm telling them, hey, let's go do this together. And the staff knowing that they're supported by us, not just by us saying it, but by seeing uh, uh, the leaders doing that, they work 10 times harder just because they feel that and they see that and stuff. And that's what I did when I was a tech, when I was a bedside nurse, I worked 10 times harder because I knew I had that physical support, not just them saying it, but I would see it day in, day out.